Hey guys, this is Christina. And as I was looking around on the internet for my next episode, I saw all these really neat little things that people were doing with coffee creamer bottles. I just got insecure. I thought you were like laughing at me. I was judging you. <laughs> Hey guys, this is Christina and this week we have 10 uses for coffee creamer containers. But not those little, those little things you get at the diner, I mean like the big ones. Peel the labels off so that they don't look janky. And apparently you have to give them forever to dry because they take a solid year. So we're gonna use it anyways. Number one, traveling snack container. So we're gonna pour these guys in here. So a couple of things that I hate about snacks. One is that you throw them in your diaper bag and they get crunched and then they become this big mess. Um, two, they go stale because this bag is terrible. And then three, like we'll be at Target or something and my kids will be complaining and throwing a fit. And then I'll end up in the baby snack aisle because you know, they can't handle actually holding something they're hand taking bites out of it, God forbid. And those puff things are $3 a container. Bam. Which one's better? Number two, store your chocolate chips. Is that really wet? Yes, I told you all my bottles are wet. Is that your pudding stuff? Like, we can't film. <laughs> okay, what do you want me to do? We can't film with a wet bottle. <laughs> what? I told you. I used a hair blue dryer on them even. This is like a hack within a hack. I'm drying the bottle gonna come out Nate. There. Number two, use them to store your chocolate chips in because otherwise you know they're gonna fall out and make a mess. They fell out and made a mess while you're did. <laughs> We're gonna start this over. I should have made a funnel. Three, pantry organization. This is a great way to organize your pantry. Number four, shake on dinner toppings. See, it's coming out. Slowly. I didn't dice them fine enough. <sighs> so this is a really great idea, but you have to make sure you chop your toppings really fine because otherwise they won't come out. Five, store your coffee. My coffee creamer container. <laughs> yep. I'm not gonna be able to pour this coffee in here without making a mess. I'm gonna take my paper make a funnel and then pour my coffee into my coffee creamer bottle without any mess. It's a hack within a hack. It's like inception. So every morning when I go to open up, when I go to make coffee, actually I don't make coffee, my husband does. And um, like grounds get everywhere on the counter. And then that's one more thing I have to clean up. This, like you just open it and you shake it into your coffee filter. That is making your life easier, it's better. It's a better way to do it, people. Good. Number six, homemade music shakers. You could use dry beans, beads, macaroni, pretty much anything that makes noise. <laughs> Number seven, a snowman marshmallow holder craft. Like, this is one of those crafts that I would do with my kids because it requires almost no parental input. I don't wanna help them. They can do this all by themselves. I don't wanna help them. <laughs> Step one figure out how to get the marshmallows in here somehow. Once you've filled it with marshmallows, you can just decorate it like a snowman. <laughs> okay, what's the difference between this and Pinterest? I think it would look better if I did this. <laughs> it <looks> worse. <laughs> See, this looks complete, it still looks like a penguin. It still looks like a penguin. Okay, moving on. Number eight is a makeshift sports drink bottle. Voila! Number nine, store homemade laundry detergent and dish soap. Number 10, homemade bowling game for the kids. So there you have it guys, 10 uses for coffee creamer bottles. Do you guys have any other better ideas? Because mostly I was just putting things into it. 
but they're really versatile bottles and I think that they could be used for a lot of things. A lot of, things. A lot of uses for, uh, you know, organizing your house. I don't know, maybe they'll be all over my kitchen next week. Who knows? Thanks so much for watching guys. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell for email updates. Have a good day. Your face, like, I'm doing this. <laughs> this, is, this is really dumb. Sorry. Okay, I'll do it again. I'm supposed to be serious about it. How can you be serious? Okay. I know you can't. <laughs> your face all the time is like, this is what I'm doing. It's so amazing. I can't do it, guys. And the other one said, what do I look like? A radio? <laughs> it's so stupid. Judging me. Stop judging me. Dude, that's not my job. It is your job, it's true. Which one's better? I did. <laughs> <laughs>